we must dedicate to our parents. Those of you whose parents have passed on, may Allah grant them Jannah. Those of you whose parents are struggling with sickness, may Allah grant them cure. Those of you whose parents perhaps do not have a good relationship with you, may Allah improve that. Sometimes there are people who are unreasonable. Like I said, parents are human beings. They are human. They would have qualities sometimes that require attention, right? Because they are human. They could make mistakes. And that's why Allah has not asked you to obey more than he's asked you to be kind. Obedience is for Allah. You look at the Quran. There's no verse that explicitly tells you to obey your parents. But rather there are verses that tell you to be kind to them. And yes, obedience in that which is pleasing to Allah is a duty. Is a duty. But my brothers and sisters, when Allah's connected you with people around you, your, like I said, your brothers, your families, it is your duty to reach out to them, to make them feel, you know what? You're a part of me and I'm a part of you. And you may be different. You might think differently. I may disagree with you strongly. But guess what? We're family. Nothing wrong in that. In fact, it's a duty. The family unit has been given so much importance in Islam. And by the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Ask those who don't have family around them how it is. They probably miss them. Or those who've never had family members because of circumstances or whatever it might have been. Ask them how they pine for that type of companionship when they see others. Imagine going out somewhere and it's just you. 